Hello everyone, Daniel here. And in this video, I want to show you how you can create a Shopify Insta feed section like this one for free. So let's get to it. So first, if you don't already have it, you want to go ahead to the Shopify app store. And search for section store. and go ahead and install it. It's free and it's not gonna slow you down or add any weird code to your theme. So don't worry. So I already got this app, so I'm just gonna go ahead to the test store where I'm gonna show you how you're gonna use the app to add the section. So it's this one. Then go ahead and go into the app. Loading, loading. I think my Wi-Fi is a little bit slow today. But, uh, let's just wait it out. Maybe a refresh. Okay, sorry, here you go. So inside the app, go to sections, tap. And then find the section, it's called InstaFeed. And as you can see, it's free. So click get free section. Okay, now it's added to your my sections here inside of the app. And then you can find the section here, InstaFeed. And go to the right side and click add to theme and then add it to a theme that you wanna edit or that you wanna add it on. So in this case, I just wanna add it to my live dawn theme so click this one successfully install that means it's going to add a section into your theme it's like a standalone section so it's not going to add anything on your front end before you go to the theme editor which you can do from the app just click theme editor oh sorry that opens a new tab i'm just gonna do it this way so just go to online store and click customize So let's just add it in here on the front page, the Insta feed section. So go to add section and search for SS for section store and then find the Insta feed. So this is how it looks out of the box. And let me just pause the video and add some images so you can see how it looks after adding image. All right. so. This is how it looks after adding images and in the section itself, there's a lot of options to customize it. Let's just play a little bit around so you get a feeling for what you can do. So here's a white background with black text. And of course you can change the text here and you can change your handle and of course add in the link for your handle. You can change the font size, you can change the padding. So you can change the image padding as well, set it to zero. So it's just gonna be side by side without any padding. Or you can add back a little padding if you prefer. And on the block level, you can add, of course, the image and you can add a URL or link to the image. And let's just check how it looks on mobile as well. So, kind of like that. And this is how it looks on mobile. Really nice as well. So if you think that it takes up too much real estate on your mobile, like the vertical space, you can actually, I created this feature so you can hide the last X amount of images that you don't want to show. So you can add in the, images that you think are most important or that's gonna show your brand in the nicest way and then you can hide the rest however you want or you can keep them all, that's up to you. All right, I hope you find this valuable. Remember the section is free and it's gonna stay that way for a long time. And the 
app itself is free as well. So I hope you find it valuable and